So we love everything about Russia. We love the Russian culture. We love Russian food. We love Russian cities. We love Russian, can't say Russian women, okay? We love everything about Russia, but unfortunately, we're not going to be practicing medicine in Russia after graduation. And here are our reasons. Russia is a very beautiful country. Russia has a lot to offer, both in employment opportunities and social life and everything you can think about a developed country. But when it comes to practicing medicine, Russia is very disadvantageous for doctors. Russia has one of the best medical schools in the world. If you study medicine in Russia, you can compete with anybody graduating from anywhere. But if you want to practice medicine in Russia, things are going to become very difficult for you. From writing the state examination, which is very difficult or almost impossible to pass, to the weather, to how much they pay, to everything everything we're gonna be telling you five reasons why we are not going to practice medicine in Russia after graduation. Alright, so the number one reason is the language barrier. The Russian language is one of the most difficult languages in the whole world. So it takes you years to learn this language and you still don't understand it completely. Even some of our colleagues that are studying in Russian language presently still don't completely understand the language. It is difficult enough trying to speak Russians on the street in conversation. Medicine itself is hard. Imagine taking one of the most difficult languages in the world and applying it to medicine. That's the reason why even if you successfully study medicine in Russian language here, it's going to be difficult for you to apply that knowledge because one, a man thinks in his first language. You you probably think in English language because you are watching this. And remember, you are in Russia. Everybody here speaks Russian language. These patients are going to speak Russian. The doctors are going to speak Russian. The instructions are going to be in Russian. So if, especially for us that studied in English medium, it's going to be impossible for us to try to, to practice here in any way, shape or form. So the language barrier is one of the biggest reasons why we're not going to practice medicine in Russia. It's not like we don't like the Russian language. We have tried. <laughs> we have tried for years to learn this language and we only know basic Russian conversational language. Number two, sanctions. Ever since the special military operations, sanctions have taken a toll especially on us foreign students. So it's difficult to acquire a lot of things, it's difficult to do a lot of things. And honestly, it's getting to a point where the Russian medical degree might not even be recognized internationally. So it's not that Russia is a bad place, it's just that it's best for us to graduate here and then go to another country to practice so as to not limit our opportunities. Before I tell you what the next point is, I'm from a place called uh, Makodi, a place in Nigeria. Temperatures hit 42 degrees centigrade in, uh, in uh, we don't have we dry season in heat season. From living in a place that has 42 degrees, I came to a place that has literally minus 9 temperatures, minus 10 temperatures on very cold days. So imagine how I survive here. So one of the reasons why we don't want to stay here for a very long time or relocate is because of the extreme weather of Russia. Russia has very extreme weather. In summer, it's really hot. You can put an egg outside in water and it will come back boiled. And then in winter, things get very cold. It, especially for us that always get infected with flu, we are always sick during winter. That is the reason why. <laughs> Alright, so I know this one was the number one reason why you clicked this video. We waited for the end because, of course, we're YouTubers. You needed to watch so that we can get more money. <laughs> Alright, I'm joking. So, the, uh, the, 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 the most important reason why we're not going to practice in Russia is this. Russia has a very sophisticated health healthcare system, but their doctors are not well compensated as compared to other European countries and America. For example, if you are practicing medicine in the US, you get compensated as a general practitioner up to $200,000 a year. That is a lot of money. Whereas if you are practicing in Russia, you as a general practitioner, you barely make about $1,000 a month. Combined, that is about $12,000 or $13,000 a year. Plus all your bonuses, plus you have to pay tax and all of that. That is the reason why we do not think it's worth it for now to practice medicine in Russia. Because, of course, I, a lot of people say I got into medicine to help people. I got into medicine because I want to help other people. If you wanted to do that, you should have started an NGO. Yes. If you wanted to do that, you should have studied other things. <laughs> All right, yes, I'm, I'm, I know I'm, I'm being very stupid right now. But I got into medicine because they compensate well. And I think that if for, before I can be able to help anybody, I, I must be in a position where I am fairly compensated and I have the resources to help those people. So that is one of the reasons why I got into medicine, because of the money. If you are getting into medicine because you want to help people generally, if you are from a comfortable family, or you are already comfortable and you want to get into medicine to help people, that is all right, that is completely fine. But for 90% of medical students, we got into medicine because medicine pays good money, and after you have been paid and you are comfortable, you can think about helping other people, even financially, out of the hospital. Senior doctors in Russia get paid less than $2,000 a month unless you're having private practice and your private practice is doing perfect. If you're working in the public sector, 
you know because public sectors are more open for employment you're going to be making less than what any doctor even in place, places like Africa are, are going to be making Sorry. Disclaimer, please we were not saying any of this to shame or actually put a debt or put debt or whatever on Russia's name. Russia is a great country, but these were just the reasons we were given to you as to why we don't want to practice here. I personally don't want to practice here, you understand? Armin doesn't want to practice here. And I know a lot of people don't also want to practice here. The people especially educated in Russia, I'm joking. But yeah, if you agree with that reasons, please put it in the comments. If you didn't, also put it in the comments. And please share, like, tell your friends, and most importantly, subscribe. And also click that notification bell so that you can get notifications of every video every Friday. Please keep watching and thank you, Medminders. Bye. Hehehe. <laughs>